You know, I think it's really interesting too because like the way he plays is very methodical in that sense and you know it, it kind of goes hand in hand with being a musician and the way you think about things yeah so it's i, I like that about uh rich brown's play style mm -hmm. so let's see uh what rich brown versus vice grip can do Three, two, one, oh my gosh just catching him with these nares now I've, I've had some friends play rich brown and they tell me that basically the way rich brown plays if he makes you feel like he, you can't do anything, really. And those nares are really showing it right now. Like, just knowing exactly what Vice is trying to do and just, like, stopping all of his, like, heart approaches. And look at that, already Okay, so already uh, Rich Brown has Vice Grip, a pretty strong uh, position for himself. Oh, he gets the Gimp there with the Nair. Oh my goodness. Fastball Nair off the stage. Yeah. Not yeah. much that Ludwig can do there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was a really, really early kill for uh, Rich Brown. And I mean, I guess from Mewtwo's floating nature and his side B, the, the Mecha Koopa is basically not in play, which gets rid of a couple of Vice Grips' options and setups. So. Yeah. Look at this! Oh Look at this! Oh my god. Rich Brown just showing out right now. On Fat Game Stream. Yeah. 2GG Abadango Saga. He's like, Abadango, who? Who? Let me show you who the who's real best. Who's the best Mewtwo? I, I think it's me. <laughs> so, uh, let's see what he can do. You know, the crazy part about the first stock, too, is that he, um,. He just built up so much d damage so quick, he didn't even kill him with uh, like a strong attack. He just got him with a Gimp. And yeah. Shadow Claw already at 100% for Ludwig and off stage. He's playing the really safe game now, which is great. No reason to approach Ludwig. He has the tools to deal with him from at a distance. A yeah. long disjointed down tilt to space with. Yeah. Oh, oh reads the roll, yep. gets the Shadow Ball, and that's going to be a solid two stock for Rich Brown right there. Really, really. And uh, Vice Grip actually not a not a sleeper at all. I mean, just that Wednesday night fights. As I said earlier, he uh, he got fourth place at Wednesday night fights, beating Tyrant actually, who we just saw. Yeah. Uh, strong 2-0 in winners. Fortunately, unfortunately, did not get the run back, but still placed very very well. And look at these combos from Rich Brown right now. And uh, like with like with Vice Grip, he only got like one back throw. Didn't quite get anything. Just a reset in neutral. But uh, the way Rich Brown's playing, he's gonna get that uh, combo situation again. Yeah. The main thing about Vice Grip right now, he's getting like these stray hits, like that back air and stuff. But he's not really getting any of his full setups. Oh my God! F smash at the ledge. Not gonna kill Mewtwo. Uh, not even good, just yet. Good DI from Rich Brown. Found the corner of the stage. If he had gotten that 10% later, he would have been. It would have been curtain. Though. Yeah. Not nice. Fair. Okay. Yeah. Sneaks his way back on stage with double fares. Takes over the stage. Okay. A whiff of smash leads to a punish, which puts Rich Brown not in the best position. Pushed up against the corner. Yeah, the shadow balls into dash attack kind of gets him off his back there. Both of these characters can't die to uh, any of their uh, solid moves right now. Yeah, and an out smash. smash. Be it. Very, very bad uh, choice from, from the side B mix up yeah. for Vice Grip. Yeah, really smart from Rich Brown no there, just knowing he can punish that way. Yeah. You know. Catches the roll again with the shadow ball. Let's see if he can get any punish off of this. Gets the, gets the nair, gets the back air. All right, that's uh, gonna be a 44% uh, situation. Oh my goodness, and these Nairs just doing so much work for Rich Brown. Like, just stopping the cart uh, options, all of them, whenever he gets anywhere near him. All right, and a fair, not the best ZI in the world. All right, well, he has the Mecha. 
lost it there. No Shadow Ball. Yeah. Rich Brown just patiently waiting once again. Yeah. K gets clipped by that forward air. Loses the stock, but still at a really advantageous. Oh my god, he just threw it out twice. He yeah, just kind of took a moment to catch his breath and landed with two up smashes. Yeah. He gets caught in the second one, but uh, yeah, no not, rage. Yeah, not quite the kill yet. But I mean, what's he got to do at this point now? He's just got to either Shadow Claw, up smash, or uh, potentially just another roll read with uh, Shadow Ball. Yeah. That All right, yep, the Nair to, to, to Shadow Claw. Yeah. So it's all the stuff for yeah. Rich Brown. Just really, really strong showing uh, that Mewtwo's actually a really fantastic character in this game. Just need a couple of buffs and then he's good. Yeah, you know, people. A lot of people complained uh, when he first came out, uh, but I think they left Mewtwo in a in a uh, position where like he should have been from the beginning. Yeah. Uh, just one of the stronger Pokemon yeah, in, the just got in the Pokemon universe. Yeah, just got the setups, just got the yeah. damage output, just got everything. So it looks like we got like, our man Captain Andrew, one of our. Uh, Sonic mains here in SoCal, uh, really, really wanting to uh, best his uh, Sonic to the full potential. One of his goals right now is to beat Phoenix, one of our uh, our our PR, our PR uh, Sonic um, player. Yeah. yeah, and then of course we have Fallen, our yeah. premier Rosa. Yeah, speaking of Phoenix, both Fallen and Phoenix being players from uh, San Diego region in yeah. SoCal. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Fallen. Uh, widely considered to be the best uh, or second best Rosa mm -hmm. behind uh, only next to the Buzz. Mm -hmm. Uh, there's some debate because of Rayquaza, but uh, he yeah. hasn't traveled nearly as much as Fallen, so he's gonna get the better. Uh, he's gonna get the benefit of uh, traveling and all that. Yeah, Sponsored no, by lots of our kind as well. You know, it's almost uh, unfair to judge uh, or compare the two, Fallen and the Buzz, because I think they have very different play styles. Yeah, you know? Fallen's uh, control of Luma is definitely much stronger than the Buzz's, I think, mm -hmm. and the uh, Buzz is very, very fundamental. Yes. Space. So. Uh, 